On these problems, you're asked to do some conversions. If you remember, uh, the most important thing we do is to, to use our unit rates, and the unit rates we talked about in class. So we start with ounces, and uh, we just go ahead and write 120 ounces down. And then we think, what is my unit rate that involves ounces? Well, I had a unit rate where 8 ounces is equivalent to one cup, or in one cup there is eight ounces. Now the reason I chose to write the fraction like this is because this ounce is in the numerator, so I need to cancel out the ounces, so it goes in the denominator. Now cups is still not quarts, so I've got to use a unit rate to try to get to quarts. Well, I do have a unit rate that connects cups and quarts, and that is that there are four cups in one quart. And so that's another unit rate, and so the cup uh, cancels, and then we've got to do, go through and do the math. You can do some simplification if you want. You might not recognize that 4 does go into 120. It goes into it 30 times. Uh, then you can look at it and see that 30 and 8 both have a 2 in it. And so it would be 15 and 2. And so your final answer is 15 over 2 quarts or 7.5 or 7.5 quarts. On the second one, we're going from inches to miles. So we're given uh, these inches, and we want to convert it to miles. So we start by, well, we don't know in the number of inches in a mile, but I do know that there are 12 inches in one foot. And that's good because now that I've converted away from the inches to feet, I need to convert the feet to miles. And I know that there are 5,280 feet in one mile. So now I have my units correct, and I just have to do the math. So 720 times 1 times 1, and then 12 times 5,280 on the denominator. I'm going to do some simplification. 12 goes into 720 60 times. Obviously, 10 goes into both these, 528 and um, 6. 2 goes into both of them, so 264 and 2, and 3. Right, so 2 goes into 6 two times, 3 times. And then uh, 264 is divisible by 3, so when I divide that by 3, I get 88. And that goes away. And so I'm left with only 1 on the top, so my answer is 188 mile, which would be a fine answer if they ask for the exact answer, the answer in um, uh, as a fraction, or you could have given me the answer as a decimal and just done 1 divided by 88 and got 0 0.01. Um, 1, 1 if you round to the nearest thousands, or just 0 0.01 if you round to the nearest um, hundredths, or it would just be 0, 0.0 if you round to the nearest tenth. That would be a bad problem to round to the nearest tenth. So your answer is 1 88th of a mile, is how many 720 inches is.